Hi guys, welcome to the upcoming episode of Skilled by Masai, um, where we share success stories of our Masai students. Uh, these are students who basically, you know, surpassed all the odds, challenges in life, and eventually found success with the help of Masai. So I am your host today, Tanya, and I'll be interviewing Pratyush Nayar, who is an SD one at Prudal Site. Um, and after doing, I think, full stack development course at Masai. So, you know, further in this episode, we will see, um, you know, why Pratyush chose Masai, his career and placement journey. Um, most importantly, how his life transitioned after Masai. And of course, the tits and bits and tits and tats of his life here and there, you know, all the fun part. So keep watching this episode, you know, to understand why skills are so important to be successful in life and how a technology plays a role in it, right? So, uh, you know, without delaying, let's start. All right. Hi, Pratyush. How are you feeling today? How are hey, you doing? Tanya. First of all, a big thanks to you for loving, uh, you know, getting me on this podcast and a big thanks to Masai as well. So I'm doing great. I'm here in Bangalore. As you say in Bangalore, the weather is great. I so know. No complaints. Yes. <laughs> so very happy about it. So, yes. And life has chal raha. Okay. Before we dig in into, you know, how you approached Masai, what took you through this journey and everything, absolutely thrilled to know that, you know, how were you as a kid, Pratyush? Like, um, kind of how were you as a kid? Um, when you little bit grew up, what did you take it? Like 10 to 11th wala jo decision that comes mm -hmm. up, you know, yeah. science, commerce. Was it a parent's pressure? Are ya, science le lo life sort hai, you know, all these kind of things. So, um, like, what do you, uh, like, I really want to know from your side. So, so uh, school life would be like, uh, you know, I'm coming from a South Indian family. So every okay. South Indian here knows that you get pretty disciplined in a South Indian family. Okay. Please. So I had, a, I still remember it. I had a timetable from the age of three. If you don't follow it, you know, your mom's <laughs> approaching you. Okay. Is it? So wow. yeah. So timetable. Tha, and due to that itself, you know, I was very disciplined right from my young age. So I used to, you know, be among the toppers in the class. Wow. Mm -hmm. And there were students who used to come up and tell me, you know, we love competing with you. And I was like, what? I have usually heard people saying the opposite. You know, comp competition is very tricky. Yeah. But for me, competition was good. It's a healthy competition. I used to always set up expectations with my competitors. They used to come and tell me, Pratyush, it's an open challenge. I'm going to beat you in this so-and-so exam. I have wow. had friends. They are still very good friends and they're still in a very good position in their life. So, awesome. so competitive during my school was the topper of the class. So pretty strong academically was very good in sports as well. Yeah. Because my mom, she's an athlete. She, she played district level sports. Is it? So oh, yeah. Oh, man, so that that's incredible. where the sports comes from. Huh? And uh, I enjoyed playing sports. I enjoyed studying. I, I wanted to take science because there was a teacher in my school. I should literally take out her name. She was Nitija, Miss Nitija. Okay. Mm -hmm. She had inspired me to take science. Like, to, like, I didn't know what I wanted to do. But science, when she started taking lessons, I was like, this is it. This is what I wanted to do. I didn't know what was the scope in science, what, what you want to do in science, what would be the future opportunities in science. I didn't know anything. I just wanted to learn science for the sake of learning it because I was in love with science. I always wanted to learn science. And she still tells me that she reserves the first bench of our classroom till date. Anyone who sits on that bench, she tells, okay, this is Pratyush Nair's seat. Oh. Be very careful. I called her last, I mean, during the last teacher's day and I told yeah. her, I miss you. And also that, this is what she told me. And I was like, so proud. <laughs> like, you know, she, she tells me. Ah, man, so, that's something. That, that's, that's a remark. Something. That's, yeah, that's about something. my academic life. So I, you get to know, like I was pretty good with my academics. Yeah. So I went ahead and took 11th grade uh, in my science as my subject in 11th grade. I wanted to become an engineer, civil engineer, because my okay. dad was into constructions. So mm -hmm. 
but later on you know during my 11th 12th grade i fell in love with physics i was like i don't want to do any engineering mm. things and everything i just wanted to do physics and it was like you know math was fine with me chemistry i was not getting chemistry i was not understanding what's happening but physics i was understanding very quickly i've heard the opposite from people yeah, but it was the, no, right i <laughs> suck yeah. at physics man no <laughs> <laughs> it, it was the opposite for me that was that was yeah. my engineering then i went and did my post grad in physics as well wow okay. and i did it from a very very brilliant university in mumbai mm-hmm. so it's called the institute of chemical technology oh you did it from ict yeah yeah, yeah. i am yeah. a post grad from ict yeah man you have a like a blinking uh, life like uh, all stars achievements and uh, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, but 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 बहुत बहुत दर्द है उसके पीछे What what's your take over skill versus degree, right? Like what what will you say? Um, a typical skill being learned since you're coming from that kind of background, uh, mm-hmm. you know, did one more skill owning in Masai, right? Versus a degree that you see a normal engineering college that offers, right? right? So kind of, um, or any college for that matter, right? So, what's your take on it? Like, we want to know it. Um, in short, that what do you really, really think strikingly about it? Okay, so it's it's very it's very simple. Okay, skills equals survival. Hmm. If you want to survive, you need skills. Yeah. There have been brilliant orators, people who very good communication skills. who have pulled great things like for example uh, steve jobs who was an excellent orator who was excellent at marketing he had a skill it was not just his degree he didn't bother about degrees absolutely so, yeah but there is a need for transformation because i think people are realizing that these days if you look at coding itself as a skill it's democratized you pretty mm. much find all the stuff you need to learn on internet so it's democracy and the most surprising part is everyone is realizing this yeah so people are realizing it degrees won't matter after a point of time but for say for example a niche field like say physics or say civil engineer mm. for those you might need a degree but yep. there are so many fields out there you don't need a degree you need a proper mm. skill because i am a person who comes from physics I loved coding. I've been coding from the uh, from my eleventh grade on and off, on and off, not continuously. Okay. But it's a skill. It's a skill. Mm-hmm. So I brushed it up. I worked on it, worked on it, worked on it again and again. There were challenges, but a skill gets recognized. A degree yep. gets recognized in the initial stage, but a skill gets recognized over a period of time of as time. a part of your survival. Wow, wow! That is it. Skills equals survival. How did Masai happen? Like, how did you find about Masai? I learned something that you know, in the field of physics, you have to become a professor to earn yeah. a good amount of money. Hmm. And becoming a professor, you need PhD. And one of my professor, no, no, you know, no hard feelings. I am not saying this for the sake of getting hard feelings. He mentioned like, but you should try and get a PhD from abroad. and this yeah. is a common statement i've heard across yep all yep. levels mm-hmm. if you are going for a phd get it from abroad and you know my financial situation was not that great you go and get a phd from abroad. it's it's not a piece of cake for me so i started thinking what can i do alternatively i had coding i loved coding so i say like uh, physics my first love coding my second love <laughs> <laughs> okay that's it so yeah. you know if you have a skill if you want, love something try make money out of it so i re- reached out to one of my friend he was a graduate in physics and he switched to coding and mm-hmm. he was working with dell at that point of time after le- he went through a boot camp he learned coding web development and when i approached him he said prach don't think about anything just dive in so that is why i started looking right. for alternatives and i hit upon an advertisement in U- on youtube itself mm-hmm. about masai and i started exploring i started learning so i thought why not okay opting that i have to do coding is one decision then opting masai to do coding uh, so what were the main reasons out of it like what, what 
you can just say let let's say the top two reasons that came into your mind to yeah. choose for saying i would say top two and i would add an additional one the first one is isa income sharing agreement so it's a no risk policy yeah you're not taking Absolutely. any risk neither is masai taking any risk on you you are not taking any risk it's a win win situation and when it's a win win situation you go ahead that is the basic fund of business as well right <laughs> so you go ahead i took it it's a deep dive i told my parents i want to go ahead. my parents have always been supportive about my career do it i did it for one month one statement that was uh you know happening that was consistently happening on both these days of orientation was mm. we are a military style coding school okay yeah so we are going to be tough if you want to survive be tough it's an open statement and that is one of the very brilliant statements that i follow in my life and i've met some people who think in the same way yeah so that is why i said like jump in let's jump in no problem hmm. so these were the two things and wow. the third one was it was said like you will need to be consistent hmm. ek performance do performance se kaam nahi chalega 6 months 7 months consistency is the consistency. key consistency we need to love the process that is these are the words that were i you know recollect from the first day of uh, you know that orientation you need to love the process absolutely kept yeah it. and rupul was one person who kept it very sh- short and crisp throughout his conversation the one statement that took out was love the process be consistent i was like yeah i am all the way in for this journey no no heart taken no problem yeah. main andar hu i think way matured for a lot of people who are hearing uh, what yeah. i personally feel um, having that kind of mindset that you know i'm coming um, not just to rush for a job but you know to make myself a better person through feedback right. so right. i think wow bang on correct so how did your first unit go like it's a trial month people usually opt out they mm-hmm. feel that okay it's something or the other happens right so yeah yeah kind of i want to understand very shortly that you know how did you feel in unit 1 that's a trial month basically yeah i remember uh, i was uh, taught by varun but oh excellent and instructor. man i was like we what love is him is this guy what is we this guy have you ever started Every... with rajat along with varun no 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 i, I, I was it's a dead I... combination it's it's, oh. it's like yeah. varun but i was like the feeling that i got you know when i was learning yaar ye to main hu ye to main hu you know he used to make you feel like that i think i you, to varun you feel like you are so important yeah he is taking a class or so i just go and check how many attendees are there oh there are 500 1000 students but why is it feeling like he is talking to me and this was not just me after every class in the first month i used to connect with some of my uh, like people whom i who were yeah. under my ia i used to ask them like how did you feel today he was like bhai he was not teaching here he was like jo main bolna chahta wo bol raha aur mujhe samajh mein aa raha this was the feeling across yeah and i was like so the first month the expectation setting of expectation was like this high when you My have an God. excellent professor you know what is coming for you jitna badhiya professor hota hai utna badhiya course ka structure hoga utna badhiya difficulty bhi hoga definitely you know what you are in for a right that was like oh my god but, but, but bang on i think when people hear varun classes i think that's a normal reaction now we are starting yeah 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 he was yeah, like he's he's absolutely excellent even when you talk to him off the classes of like, the class yeah the that non tech stuff so correct. yeah he I used think, to be like you know uh nahi samajh mein aa raha aapko Hmm. कोई बात नहीं सो पीपल यूज टू गेट डीमोटिवेटेड या एंड ही यूज टू मोटिवेट देम इन अ वे लाइक ओके कोई बात नहीं माइक ऑन करो हम बात करेंगे अच्छा आपको ये नहीं समझा ये नहीं समझा ये अरे यार इतने प्यार से समझा रहे हो यार यू आर लाइक माय गॉड दिस इज ब्रिलियंट मैन वाओ सो आई थिंक वरुण मेड योर काइंड ऑफ हाईलाइट एंड मेड योर फर्स्ट यूनिट अ सर्वाइवल वेरी या 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 absolutely and i think he's a very humble personality uh, no matter how much knowledge he has in life 
he he's the most humble person like right right you meet in person he makes you feel like you're looking into a mirror you Absolutely. are him he is you yeah you very few and people do that i don't know do how that. he does it for the 500 students in class i, I... don't know. that's a some magic power he owns right but... right 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 yes absolutely i'm sure you are good at lot of things right but mm-hmm. the parts that you know like construct week may you learn collaboration team work right um you learn how to teach others how to learn from others right yeah. so kind of holistic development you learned how to make a better resume probably how to crisp mm-hmm. information let's say that way right? right so can i like take a word from you or just understand that okay um all these parts did they help you in placement it's a process okay so what happens is like for example you mentioned construct week Mm-hmm. you are meeting completely new people you don't even know them correct they are coming and you five of un- five unknown people are building a project mm-hmm. however great that project might be however not so good that project might be mm-hmm. but the first thing people take into notice paanch anjan log the unhone milke banaya iska matlab they might have talked among themselves they might have collaborated so that is where collaboration comes in I'm so happy to tell you that some of the people I've met in those construct week are very good friends of mine now. Wow! Wow! Okay, yeah. very good friends of mine. I just had a call today morning with one of the guy. Did you tell that you are coming for a special video? <laughs> yeah, show? yeah, yeah. So he 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 told like mention about us. Okay, we were in the project and he told. Us. So shout out to him. I'm mentioning you. Okay, <laughs> so collaboration. I learned collaboration there. second is uh, you know resume and stuff like that mm. a bit more technical terms you are taught like what to put what not to put yeah your portfolio how important is your portfolio ye sab pehle dekha jata hai and then an interview happens mm. so when an interview happens if you are genuine okay if you have genuinely collaborated if you have ge- been genuine in the process yeah wo answer aapko banana nahi padta correct it comes automatically i remember this in- uh, this uh, like when my first interview happened here at plural site and one of our manager she she interviewed me and after the interview she asked like do you have any question and i told her ma'am uh, this is my first interview in my life okay how did you feel like you know when i gave the interview any any feedback you know, she said like pratish i don't know where you bring this confidence from go uh. with the same confidence for the second <laughs> round of interview that's all i have to say I was like, oh, I was confident. The reason I was confident was because I knew what I was doing. Yeah. I knew my resume was good. I knew my portfolio was good. I knew my collaboration was good. So, who ata? All the people who were there at Plural Sites interview, all the ones who got selected, okay, they had this confidence. They yeah. still have that confidence. I'm sure. I I I I passed out uh, with learning JavaScript. Mm-hmm. Today I'm also working in Python. Do I know that completely? No. No. I can handle But it. Can you do it? Yes. Yes. We leave things, right? We go to mm. next part, next chapter of our life. But mm. few things always stay with us. No matter right. what, you still name that teacher, right? Mm. And I think मरते दम तक भी आपका वो teacher का नाम रहेगा जुबान पे. Maybe you tell to your grandkids, grand grandkids. I don't know, right? Mm. but the same happens with me there are few things that stays with me forever my life right i can right. never forget so i would like to put it in a way yeah three key learnings or three beautiful things that stayed with you after masai first one first and the most important dedication yeah dedication ke it's an umbrella under which a lot of things come if you are dedicated enough right you will be hard working you will be patient enough you will be self disciplined Yeah. Yeah. Three things, which is very important for success, comes under the umbrella of dedication. This is what I have learned. If you are dedicated enough and dedicatedly, you are seven months giving it. In any other thing, not just massage, mm-hmm. anything, you will be that thing. You will own that thing. You will hundred percent. So think. that is first thing. Yeah. You might not master it. Mastery is a very few people in life. In any other field, but you will own it. You will be the master of your own game. Yeah. Dedication, first. second loving the process there is a there is a there was an anime uh, it's a kids anime but it's a very good anime okay 
so in that there is one dialogue which which hit me it was like results are for kids the adults go for the process yeah oh and my god and it yes. was like when i yes. heard that it was like whoa <laughs> and then i heard another famous personality speaking about it and it was none other than ms dhoni yeah when oh. captain cool says it it is and that is yeah. that if you look at it much i carefully it's a journey right mm-hmm. so you have to love that process wo process agar tum if you don't like that process you will drop mm-hmm. it's a 100% guarantee will drop and i'm not saying dropping is bad and stuff like that. i'm not criticizing you or i'm not judging you but bhai ek bar process se pyar karke dekho uske baad aapko drop karne ka man nahi karega it's addictive process is addictive Thanks for a, teaching me something, Prithvi. I think a, I am learning today. Because look at Virat Kohli, right? He he has followed that process, and every time I'm sure, every time he steps onto the field, he will feel the same feeling he felt the first time. Yeah, that the underlying process. rush should be maintained. Maintained. I think, at all and look at him when he's off the field and on the field. Field pe na uska process alag hota hai and he's aggressive because that is his process. Love the process. That is the second point. Third will be. listen to your mentors okay yeah they know certain things which about you which even you don't know hmm the reason Correct. why i'm saying this is like some difficulties in placements and like i reached out to ankush and he was like you will get placed why are you worried you are going to get placed <laughs> i was like whoa this guy ankush has no like confidence about me yeah. right about me then myself he knows some he he is not just saying it for the sake of saying it He's saying it because he might have observed me. He might have known me. Of course, of course, yes. People might have observed me, and that is why they say, "Okay, it's perfect. You can do it, bro. You can do it." So listen to your mentors. They might know some things which you yourself don't know. These are the three mm. things: dedication, Absolutely. love the process, listen to your mentors. I learned something today from you. To be honest, yeah. um, sometimes when we get frustrated, ki yar, we can be be calm. करना पड़ रहा है या Working like this, I think a loving process will eliminate all those complaints in life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I would like to understand. Um, मुझे पता है तुम physics professor बहुत अच्छे बनते प्रत्युष, ठीक है? हाँ. But life had different plans for you. So I would like to understand. Let's say in one line or one word, um, you know, your life before and after Masai. Okay. before uh, before uh, so before masai i was like you know the process part i said i was very impatient with it i was not very patient masai 6 months you are on your toes so 6 yeah. months you learn patience hmm. so before masai slightly impatient yeah after masai very patient <laughs> very okay, patient said, i was very patient very patient i think yeah. that shows That what Herav the way you said was amazing. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. perfect. I think I think you summed it up best. I think cool. Yes, I think and patience is a skill in itself. I don't know. Right, right, right. It's the toughest skill, even tougher than coding, even tougher than physics. I think overall right, right, patience. Right. The one who has owned patience in life, na Pratyush. I think. वो वैसे जीत गया लाइफ में आई फील लाइक दैट आल्सो वन मोर पॉइंट आई वुड लाइक टू पुट लाइक आफ्टर मसाई आई हैव स्टार्टेड दिस 6 मंथ चैलेंज थिंग छे अगले 6 महीने में क्या करना है अगले 6 महीने में क्या करना है यू नो लाइफ अभी 6 6 महीने का विंडो बन गया आई डोंट नो व्हाई बट दिस इज हैपेंड आफ्टर मसाई इतना रगड़ा तुमको 6 महीने प्रत्युष आई थिंक तुम्हारे जीवन में वो 6 6 महीने का विंडो बन गया है ओ एंड आई सॉ इट इन वन ऑफ द यू नो वन ऑफ द टॉक्स आई डोंट रिमेंबर द पर्सन ही सेड द सेम थिंग Give six months to yourself, and after the six months, see who you were yeah. back before six months and after six. You will Absolutely. see a massive difference. Massive difference. So Absolutely. I think six months, six months is good. Yes, yes. I think I met a person. Uh, you know, I was just interviewing him, not for this, but just in general. So uh-huh. he told me that he has read it somewhere. One, two, three, funda. Now, okay. what is it? Um, choose one thing that you want to achieve. Uh-huh. Do it. Two hours daily, right. and see the difference after three months. Oh, oh, just, just, oh. just repeat it. Like, and I was like, "Usne ek baar bola until today, it hits me hard." Right, 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 right. 
just just imagine what he said to us that is that is big that is very precise one, and crisp yeah and he said i did that in masai right i took unit by unit uh project by project and i came he was not a achiever he was a very mediocre student with 60 percent in 12 standard um you know but i think the attitude and positive mindset that masai gave him i think that did wonders yeah. for him. he had not a, got a single a sync in his entire journey right so that uh, that comes with mindset okay yeah that, that comes with mindset that comes with consistency agar wo bol raha hai 2 ghante dega to he gave it he gave it so it's just not speaking but also acting on it right 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 so i think your mindset absolutely. changes after masa I, i mean like i've met every every individual who works with me there are around 15 17 of us from masai oh, sorry 15 of us from masai in my company everyone has a mindset and you know yeah. the the vps and our engineering leaders they say the same thing you guys you are learning it so quickly yeah and already many of us have been complimented multiple times here at rural side and our yeah. leaders they call it out you know we don't know what it is but you guys are picking it very quickly yeah so wo mindset jo hai na wo bahut important hai absolutely that you get in 6 months yeah. we we brought a lot of sneakers and all me my brothers are crazy about sneakers we spent a good amount of money in purchasing sneakers i then gifted it to my other brothers i didn't keep it for myself i don't you know i didn't keep it i gave it to three of my other brothers so they all got a sneakers and additionally they got gifts from me so that is how i spent my first salary second salary i started spending it on myself it's so funny i burnt my salary I could not purchase anything for my parents and my sister. It is in the second salary I got it for them. <laughs> they didn't feel bad about it because they knew I wanted to, you know, enjoy with my cousins. So, second salary was like spe- second salary was even special for me. People mm-hmm. say first salary is special for me. It was the second salary because I could see my mom's face, my dad's face when I gifted them some something. Yeah, my sister, I... she was so happy. So wow. yeah, that was I my special salary. Brilliant, Pratyush. I think. Uh... so nice man i think i am just i i got lost because i was thinking about my first salary 5 years back so oh. <laughs> cool nice 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 okay so pratyush i want to understand i'm sure your mom and dad would have been super proud your sister would have been your pillar but did you see any opinion change of your friends and family when you got placed as a coder so did you see any kind of um you know love coming in extra or appreciation coming in extra like everybody has different you know uh, ways so did you find anything different i was i was expecting for it mai chahta tha aisa kuch hoda extra this but no my parents like they were like they have seen me okay do things so if if i set my mind i get it yeah. so extra kuch nahi mom was very proud so, it was not just because it was like because of pride i asked my dad dad are you proud of me and he said you know you you are a guy who does not need to do anything for me to get pride i used to feel like that but you know in this moment when you tell me like you have a job this is what he told me जिनको आप बचपन से हाथ पकड़ के चला रहे थे वो आज इतने काबिल बन गए कि वो आपका हाथ पकड़ सकते हैं एंड ही वॉज दैट हिट मी वेरी हार्ड ओके सो इट वॉज नॉट लव एक्स्ट्रा इट वॉज प्राइड एक्स्ट्रा देर ऑलवेज वेरी प्राउड ऑफ मी दे वॉज कभी तो माई डैड ही स्टिल से इज लाइक यू नो आई कैन नॉट इवन इमेजिन लाइक वॉट यूर अचीव इट्स इट्स वे टू मच ही नाउ से लाइक यू नो आई कैन रेस्ट नाउ Uh, wow. That that is what he he says, and my sister she will like my sister she will like she she always keeps me grounded. So I have learned hard work from my younger sister. Mm-hmm. She she slogs way more than me. <laughs> so she was like she said something like which which really hit me very differently. She said yeah. there was no doubt in me like you will you know you will get a great job or not you will get it. Of course. And I was like oh my god. and she looks up um, to me that is what she said and you know it was not love it was like pride you know 
a pride that touches your wow. ego so wow, it, it, wow. it was that beautiful very beautiful wow my heart is full i can imagine your position pratish yeah, at yeah, that yeah. time i mean i i i have no words i'm sorry i do not want to say anything over yeah, it yeah. These Even I didn't. Simple... I didn't believe my dad would come up with something so yeah. poetic, <laughs> and he came up at that moment. I was like, "Where did you read it?" Yeah, mm, I... yeah. He, he's an avid reader, so he might have read it from somewhere. Read it, yeah. But okay. when he said that, it was special, very special. Wow. Yeah, I think. Um, I know. I I do not want to say anything on it. These are some raw emotions that came. And... Oh, friends, friends. Oh, oh, I forgot to mention my friends. Friends were like friends were the same. They 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 just said one thing. तू कितना भी ऊपर जा, तो उतना ही बेवकूफ है जब हाँ तुझे हम पहले मिले थे और तू हमेशा बेवकूफ ही रहेगा हमारे लिए. They they are friends for you. Yeah, that that is that is the definition of friendship. Friendship. No, मतलब मेरे को समझ नहीं आता अगर आप friends में intelligence ले आए तो फिर वो friendship नहीं रही ना. नहीं रहेगा. I I told you right. One of my friend he said. Prithvi, Prithvi, Raj, Prithvi. He he told me like, you if you are coming and asking, shall I do? Tell me, I'm telling you, go ahead and do it. The graduation yeah. who had done that. I told him like, bro, I got I got a job. I got placed in Bangalore. I was like, whoa. He said like, I feel proud about myself. I was like, what? Yeah, was I asked you to do web development, right? So I, you are a web developer. Who mere mere tax is jud raha. I'm very proud of myself. I was like, my God. And he he is not just my friend. He's my mentor actually. Same age. For a guy to be, you know, a mentor of the same age, he's very special. Very yeah. special person. Very special. So. Yeah. Let's have a quick question mm-hmm. around. I want you to define one word or a one liner for Masai. Okay, one liner. One liner, one word, your choice. Okay, but I'll give you a one liner. Okay. Uh, for the toughest. By the best. Damn, you guys yeah. are nailing it, man! Which is oh my god, for the toughest, but for the best. Cool. Yeah. Absolutely, I think. Okay, done. No, no more uh, dwelling on it. Uh, given, <laughs> it's an absolute perfect answer. Okay, so finally, uh, before we wrap this pretty amazing, informative, and you know, deep talks interview, I think uh, I want you to say something for the viewers in terms of if they want to join Masai, if mm-hmm. they are lost in life, so how will Masai help them? Kind of mm-hmm. to give a direction or a mindset. So just a quick message for the viewers. So yeah. so anyone who wants to join us okay so first thing is pehla mat free hai aapke liye correct right so that those are 30 days and if anyone has watched that series called tbf aspirants usme jitu bhaiya ne bola hai 21 din lagta hai ek habit set karne ko and here you have to go to 30 days right so take those 21 days blindly if you have a If you even have an inner voice saying you like, "Yeah, I want to do it," mm-hmm. not just because I want some salary, job, वो सब आप बाद में expectations लाओ. पहले अपने आप को test करो एक महीने के लिए. Correct. उसके लिए तो कोई fee नहीं लग रहा है ना. Go ahead, take it. Majority of you will go into the second unit. Yes. Okay. Will go into the third, and you will continue. But वहाँ पे आपको will लगेगा. You need a strong will. I know. And nothing, the greatest achieve the great, because they have gone through the toughest times. Yeah. If you haven't gone through toughest times, you are not going to achieve greatest. So yeah. if you are ready to be uncomfortable, and make being uncomfortable, getting comfortable with being uncomfortable, definitely go ahead and join us. पहले एक महीना try करो, hundred percent try करो, क्योंकि it will be an experience for you. कि यार I'm getting up in the morning. I'm doing something. I'm sleeping late in the night. I'm getting dreams about coding and stuff like that. It's a blissful experience. Absolutely, yes. Do it. Wow. Do it. So that will be my mantra. Puch puch test karna apne andar. At least jaake enroll karo ek mahina. Mm. Test it for yourself. You will do it. Because you wanna stop the show. Oh my god! I'm gonna put that as a header. Stop the show. 
my god this is so nice man yeah so that, that's mm-hmm. that's that that is how i went in and see look where i am today i am very happy career wise very yes. happy yes touch wood touch wood um pratyush i think excellent talking to you um the way you were very honest about your failures honest about you know because someone i'll tell you a reality because someone who has achieved much better than others right often shies away talking about their failures they feel nahi mm-hmm. mera to shiny story hi suno right mm-hmm. and coming up telling your you know coming people in masai or any of your viewers that okay it's okay to accept to crash your expectations but building on it again is important right, right. Uh, dedication being toughest in the room is important right, right? will is important right soft nasha is important to have of something right of course i cannot miss that word so i think um, i i i think you give a lot of inspiration out there with mm-hmm. your own story journey right and i'm glad masai happened to you we could help you out pratik could help you out instructors could help you out rupul could help you out right i'm sure uh, you know they'll be very happy to hear wherever you are in life so thanks a lot again for giving us your valuable time right i know how developers life is so busy but giving your time between badminton and football somewhere in middle thank yeah. you so much uh, you know it was great great interviewing you pratyush right so thank you and uh, all the best for your future endeavors again thank you thank you thank so you much. so much thank you so much grateful for you guys thank you <laughs> have a great have a great time guys yeah.